Well, welcome. Today we have a special announcement. Uh, we have Sebastian and Topias here with me, and they're here to talk about Old G. Okay, tell me a little bit more about this project, guys. <laughs> I should never have agreed to this name, by the way. <laughs> I feel like I actually was not even in the conversation about the name. I just had to register on that name. Um, yeah, tell you a little bit more, uh, more about it. Um, I mean, basically, we decided that we wanted to, since we're all we were all planning to play a bit of Dota uh, here and there, you know, either pubs or um, whatever, really. Uh, then we realized, what if we just, instead of hitting this uh, player, like play Dota or play ranked, is it, I guess, I think it's play Dota. Uh, yeah, I hit it so many times, I still don't know what it is. Uh, instead of hitting this button, what about we just get together and play some games from time to time, you know, whether it's scrims or whether it's um, official games. It sounds like much more fun. We'd be playing with people we enjoy playing with and also playing Dota we we believe in more. So and then we sat down and talked about that and we're like, yeah, that sounds that sounds awesome. You know, let's just do it. And we went on and and, and tried to talk with players that we really enjoyed, like the, how they view the game and how they play the game, and that could kind of really fit fit in to how we wanna enjoy Dota, basically, because it's really about that. Um, and they were fully on board, and then we realized that yeah, we have something that we can put together that can that can be a lot of fun. Because basically, we're not looking, we're not. And that's also why this has nothing to do with OG right now. As in, like we, we we're not. This isn't like a team. As in, we're not competing. You know, we're not uh, aiming. We're not putting pressure on ourselves. We're not here to perform. We're not here to attend tournaments. We're literally, we're just chilling. Like, we're actually just chilling, playing some Dota, which, I mean, we'll get to that, but it's it's a lot of fun. I think it's the most fun I've had playing uh, games since maybe pre-TI8. So that's amazing. And, uh, and yeah, we're just going to chill in Div 2. You know, we're hoping to get some games against Gork C, but there are rumors that he might, he, he might not be there. I mean, to be fair, we're not in Div 2 yet. We might just not make it. Uh, and if we don't, we're also fine with that. You know, basically, we kind of set that we're going to have a certain amount of games we're going to play together at certain times of the year. And whether these games are just scrims or Battle Cup <laughs> or Div 2 or Div 1 or Major Finals or whatever, then it's what it's going to be, you know. Um, so that's really it, honestly. Um it's a fun, it's a super fun project, fun team. Obviously, it's in our DNA to play Dota a certain way. Uh, so it's not fun in a way that we're going to just, uh, um, you know, mess around in the games or or just troll or, I mean, mess around. I was going to say, maybe we too far. I see your screen. I mean, <laughs> when we mess around, we still try to win. But you know okay. what I mean? Like, as in, it, it, it's fun in the sense that, like, uh, we we are really chill with it. But, of course, we have a certain way to play Dota. And, and I think that way is just in our DNA and that can't really go away. So, yeah, um, honestly, that's how the, the, that's it. How, how do you feel, Top? Just like, did I sum it up properly or is there something else you you feel should yeah. be said about this? Good. <laughs> <laughs> nice, I got the thumbs up. <laughs> that's all I'm going to say. <laughs> oh, nice. How, how, how has it been so far? Uh, uh, it's been good. I think yeah. we, we probably... Are getting like a better idea of how to play together and yeah like i think it's like a lot of ideas a lot of talking and stuff and i mean it's, it's good that we get to play some games also and i'm really excited for the qualifiers let's see how we do yeah, that's awesome. yeah it's been a lot of and fun how do you guys put the team together so obviously it was the team is johan Seb, and Tobias, you know <laughs> we're bringing the the old gs that's the one and then we have the the new guys so you guys wanted somebody that wanted to buy with you guys and you explain to them that maybe this is not like the high level thing or not high level, the commitment, you know, or yeah. how did the team came about? It's like um, we talked to them about the project that it would be quite chill, uh, that maybe at some point it will be less chill. It really depends, like full freedom to individuals to either say, hey guys, do you, wanna, do you want the next two weeks to be packed with Dora? Do you want to like try hard as, in, as the other teams would kind of? You know, sit down, play every day, or do we not want no Dota at all for the next two months? You just show up for the games and get stumped and <laughs> and walk away, like stuff like that. Uh, you know, like full freedom and 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 use the time to also align on how we view the game and because 
and basically we wanted players that obviously we we really enjoyed in terms of micro like how they play and how they how they play their heroes how they play the game and you know no one in mss both of them are like truly amazing players like they're really really good we have competed against them enough to to, to feel the pain of playing with such players of that caliber but we also were looking for players that were able to put words on things and able to break the game down together you know really be on the same page because for years we've been about um getting players to understand um certain things or certain aspect of the game um and it takes a lot of time it takes a lot of energy and we none of us were really willing to dedicate that amount of time and energy and it goes both ways right we're not teaching they're also teaching us back and i'm sure they also have experienced that themselves uh, but basically we just wanted a full group of people that hey you talk about something otherwise it doesn't need to be broken down everybody understands what this is about and all the implications it's just about whether or not we want to make it happen if that makes sense we're, we're not building the theory we're just choosing amongst the playbook like hey do you want to play this way or do you want to do that and obviously there's a lot of um of fine tuning to be done you know um and i'm not saying that there's no work put in but you know it's um it's stage two, stage three work instead of like building really the foundations of, 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 of Dota theory, which is super fun. And it requires also less time, which means you can, you can get better by just talking. You can get better by just thinking about ideas and then executing them in the games. It comes much quicker instead of taking 20 games. It might just take two games and, and then everybody kind of understands uh, and does it properly. So. Yeah, I mean, that, that part is cool. And I think having zero expectations, that is also very fun. Like having literally zero is like, I think we would, I would go in some of these scrims and sometimes we play versus very good teams and, and we beat them and it's fun. And sometimes we play versus teams that are completely unknown and we get stomped and it's also very fun. Like, and I think that part is really nice because we've all competed with this urge to, we got to win this game. You know, like uh, we got we, we to gotta beat that team. We got to win this game. And this isn't about that at all. This is about having fun and about we're just like the win is because we're super excited about testing something you know uh and get, seeing it through in the game and we're kind of making it happen the best we can um whether we win or lose and 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 the same amount of kind of having fun together you know spending a good time and spending like a nice two hours uh and th th that part is really here it's super present and it makes the whole dota better so we know that us getting together, like the three of us, and adding no one in MSS, which are you know like amazing players, and now the group, you know, it can it can it looks exciting probably for a lot of people out there that are looking forward to see how this team performs and how this team competes, um, and yeah, hopefully we can deliver you know some nice Dota at some point, and it's gonna be enjoyable. Uh, but truth be told, right now this isn't the aim of it, so we really don't want people to be misled into thinking that this is a team, this is the team they're gonna see a lot and get to see in tournaments and lands because that's really not the the point right now so whatever we get to see you know great and we'll always be trying our best as i said it's really in our dna but at the same time we might also not be visible whatsoever let's say we lose qualifiers well that's there's not going to be anything any game being played for maybe months and that's fine or maybe we'll play games kind of in the in the shadows but that's not going to be seen anywhere um so it's just really to Get 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 set the record straight that there is zero. You should have zero expectations <laughs> from this team, you know. Mm -hmm. uh, and if you see something and it and, and you like it, then good, you know. It might go away as quick as it came. Uh, so that's just the the tone of it. And then we felt like being affiliated with with OG or being a, 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 anything like that would send, send send the wrong message and would just be confusing. Okay. Tobias, you told me that you're going to still continue to stream and you're going to continue doing your things, right? This is, yep. is that correct? Because at least we get to hope to see you guys all the time streaming and all that. So that's my hope. Yeah, I mean, now we've been practicing, of course, a bit since the qualifier is coming. So I've been not having as much time to stream. But yeah, when we don't have games, you're probably going to see me streaming. So yeah, that's probably going to be my life streaming and playing at the side, like 50-50 kind of thing. Yeah. That's awesome. Well, this is the updates. We're all very excited. As much as we are not going to try to be excited, I'm sure we're all going to get excited. And, you know, have fun. Have fun with the games and let's see how it goes. 
Yeah, don't hate on us when we lose because we're gonna lose a lot. So just be <laughs> be ready for that. So they're gonna try some crazy stuff. So just uh, bear with us, you know. Like just enjoy the attempt. Uh, don't look at the end of the road. Come on, guys. <laughs> awesome. Thank you so much, everybody, and good luck, boys.